Tymir Patterson, also known as Skoom, is a member of the subset Drench Gang, which is a part of the NLMB gang. Drench Gang is a sub clique that consists of the shorties of NLMB. They range from the ages 15 to 17 and can be found on 79th and Essex. NLMB is broken and up into other subsets based on location and age. Those other subsets are Shorty Mob, Situation Squad, Terror Boys, and Gateway. Before the streets. Before Skoom jumped into the streets, he used to play basketball. He was the starting point guard for Hyde Park Academy and was very talented. He was listed as the number 20 PG in the top 50 players in the state of Illinois. Skoom got his first taste of the streets at a young age when his close friend, Markel Lewis, was shot and killed. After the death of his friend, he decided to join the other teenagers who were involved in the gang that resided on his block, Drench Gang. The Death of Trell Wilson, G. Trello, NLMB G. Trello was a well-respected member of NLMB who was in the, Terror Boys, subset. He was shot and killed in early August by KTS members, which was the first body in the war between NLMB and KTS. Before G. Trello died, Skoom and G. Trello would actually make a song called, Smith and Wesson. The song would become a viral anthem and would put the two rappers and NLMB on the map. They scored over 62,000 views in less than a month. Skoom started putting in work for his set right at the jump. In mid-August, Skoom would catch his first body, Ra Ra. Skoom and Ra Ra, who was in the set KTS, were enemies who often dissed each other on social media. One day, the two would go on Instagram Live and Skoom requested Ra Ra to drop his location. Ra Ra told Skoom he was at the local McDonald's and Skoom gathered some members and they made their way to the location. Ra Ra and other affiliates walked into McDonald's thinking nothing of it. A little while later, Skoom and his affiliates arrived and shouted at Ra Ra and his crew. Ra Ra and his crew stayed inside in fear for their lives, but that didn't stop Skoom and his affiliates. They opened fire from outside the store and got into a shootout with them. Ra Ra and another member, Lil Cap, were shot in this altercation. The two were rushed to the hospital where Lil Cap survived his injuries but Ra Ra sadly succumbed to his gunshot wounds. <laughs> 